What is up, you guys? What's up? What's poppin'? What is up, you guys? It's your girl TT back again with another video. As you know, I'm hyped because I just picked up the camera. I don't know. Every single time I pick up the camera, I get hyped. So get used to me getting hyped like this. So this is gonna be a reaction video. Don't mind my heater. Yup, it's back up again, being ghetto. So yeah. What are we reacting to? You may ask. Maybe not. Reacting to we should leave him for a sugar daddy <laughs> by UDY loyalty test. Now I've been watching him, right? So I was sitting down, I just finished smoking. So if I'm feeling like if I'm talking mellow, it's because I just finished smoking. So weed. Smoking weed. Yeah. Same down, just finished smoking. So he uploaded this video three days ago. I was about to watch it. And I was like, wait. I just, I'd rather just react my react like me you know what I'm trying to say yes I'm probably gonna most likely gonna have the volume like I'm gonna cut it out cut it in and out while I'm like responding and stuff because it's acting ghetto and I want you guys to enjoy the video okay will Josh's girlfriend become another man's sugar baby today we put together a test to help him find out do you know like how many guys she was talking to on the site? Like was she talking to just one or was she talking to like multiple? I don't want to know. I don't want to know. So we actually met Josh on the sets of our other channel. After the shoot, he told us that he wanted to pull this test because he caught Becca using a sugar dating app behind his- I ain't gonna hold you. He look OD nervous. OD nervous. Like he looked like he got no faith. He got no faith on his girl. Back. Other men were paying Becca to talk on the phone, go on dates, and possibly even more. I'm sure Becca was making a lot of money, but Josh wasn't cool with it. Like morally, or not even morally, for the sake of the relationship, how is that right? Like it doesn't fly with you? No. Your girl is going on a date with another guy, but she's not doing anything with them. Regardless, that's- Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. In my relationship, I wouldn't- mm, I would condone it, because- He's not having sex with her. You know? If it was vice versa and that was my partner, I wouldn't. I mean, I would condone. Not even condone. Like, I wouldn't even mind. Like, I wouldn't mind. He should accept it because it's just about the bag. It's not about the person. If no, there's no sex involved. There's no kissing. It's just me going on a date and they paying me. Up. Josh worked things out with Becca because she told him that she wouldn't have been on the app if she knew that he wasn't okay with it. Well, today Josh is gonna find out if that's true with this test. First and foremost, how are you doing, dude? I'm doing good. It's you look actually good. good to be back. It's good to be back. <laughs> if I know most of y'all probably watched his videos because he began millions of views, but if y'all don't know him, he was from live like um, text. He texted him to help him to see if his girlfriend was cheating on him type shit. Yeah, y'all go watch that. I'm not even going to spoil it. Y'all just go watch that. But, yeah, he was on the other video, so. <laughs> the thoughts of uh, being a sugar daddy is uh, funny, but <laughs> definitely grateful and appreciative to actually be here, come back, and actually get back and help with everything. Hello? Yo, yo, just making sure that you guys are still coming through. Yeah, everything's good. We're still coming through. All right, cool. We'll see you when you get here then. All right, see you. So this is where we're going to be watching and listening in to everything that's happening upstairs. We left Carlos there. He's by himself. We're just waiting for Josh to arrive. Yo, what's good, Yosh? All right, smooth, smooth. Stay where you are. I'm just going to come get you because it's low-key a mission. I'm going to head down right now. Yo. All right, this is it. Carlos would help Josh how his friend Dorian once helped him. He will pretend to be rich and ask Becca to become his sugar baby. Being that Becca now knows that Josh wouldn't be cool with this, she should have no issue in turning Carlos down. Unless, of course, she simply isn't loyal. Crib, though. I'll be waking up to this every single morning. Carlos was pretending to be Josh's- Oh, no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. am I going inside a crib? And they, they, that's the first thing they said, like, they don't even say welcome to my crib. You're like, oh, I'm so glad I wake up to this every day. I'm just, uh, is this just me? I'm just thinking, sus, like, the, if you've been here for a while. I don't know. 
Josh's good friend who just bought this luxury condo. Josh managed to bring Becca here by convincing her to come check it out with him. Yeah, this is the living room. Of course, you got the great view. If you guys come over here, it's actually the bedroom. Everything is looking good so far. I honestly hope she passes the test for Josh's sake. Let me go ahead and let me show you guys the balcony. This guy's so rich, he just has hundreds in the couch. <sighs> oh, yeah, go ahead and leave that there. I'll probably like do something with it, I don't know. Come outside, enjoy the view. Oh, why do you do her like that? Why do you do her like that? Nice. Know, Josh almost blew our cover. The Billy found was not real, but luckily Becca didn't make much of it and just set it on the counter. Y'all see the view? It's mad beautiful out here. We now had to get Josh out of there so that Carlos could make his move, but we had to do so without making Becca suspicious. We are going to give them a lot of time to get comfortable with each other and just break the ice. Carlos would have given Josh his key to leave when he felt that Becca was comfortable enough to stay on her own. He introduced her to his dog, Yuki. Hi! Yeah, she's still a baby. Have you got a little bit of And he even went as far as to ordering food from a nearby restaurant. Oh, the good one. Yeah, yes sir, appreciate you. Have a good one. Baby. You want to say bye before I put it down? Oh, You guys will probably not feel how long this test is because it'll be edited, but like, I'm doing it. Hey bro, now that I think of it, where'd you park it? No, sir. Oh, this is it, guys. Bro, they towed like a mother here. My dead ass. Come out to the balcony room. I'm gonna show you exactly where you can park. Come over here. At last, Carlos gave Josh's key to make his exit. So you see the parking lot across the street? So you're good living in any of those spots. I'm gonna my car right now. You gonna move right now? No, it's okay, thank you. This is very cool, yeah. Perfect. Take this. Get lost, bro. Hit me, bro. I'll be getting lost myself around here. Josh is pretending to go move his car so that it doesn't get towed, but in reality, he is making his way over to us. Damn, my bad. I should have definitely told him about parking when she got pulled up here. Where is he, where is he? What is good, my guy? What's good? Good to see you. How you doing? You ready for this? Let's get you mic'd up and. Oh my god, he looks so nervous. He looks so nervous. He have no faith. Like, <laughs> so let's figure out how we're gonna sit down here. But how's everything been? Good. Yeah, everything's good with you. Yeah. Work. Yeah. Not the food industry be super ass. I mean, it's okay. I like. I'm not a huge fan of my like managers. Carlos was now free to make his move, but first we were gonna have Josh give him a quick phone call. The last thing we want is Becca thinking that you're gonna walk in through the door at any minute. So hopefully with this phone call, she thinks that you're gonna be away for at least 20 minutes and that'll give Carlos plenty of time to make a move on her without her being scared that you're gonna walk in through the door and stuff. Oh, hold on. Yosh? Hey bro, I kinda wanted an energy drink. Do you, would you happen to have any in your fridge? Bro, to be honest, I don't. I know that there's like a gas station or a liquor store that's like a couple blocks away maybe. I'm gonna grab some. Alright, bet. I'll see you in like 20 minutes, okay? Sounds good, bro. So Josh? Yeah. He's so he, yeah, he said he's probably gonna be like maybe like 20 minutes. Cool. So we just bought Carlos 20 minutes to make his move. Hey, you're actually a good a good vibe. You seem like a good person. You seem super bright. You know, you're super energetic. You have a contagious smile, you know, so. Actually, do you have a, can I use your restroom? Uh, yeah, if you come over here, it's right here in the bedroom. Oh, dang, she, she used the restroom. Yeah, just uh, make sure you take off your shoes too. I just really don't want to get my carpet dirty. Yeah, I Yeah, it. I just like to keep the carpet clean. Dang, we bought them 20 minutes and Becca's burning through them in the restroom. <laughs> Really quick, sir. Can I have you actually stay over here in the middle? Because when you come this way, his face gets in your way. There we go. Perfect. <clears throat> All right, here we go, guys. Becca's out of the restroom. Everything okay? It was the, the needed a good angle for me. All right, smooth, smooth, smooth. Yeah, you go ahead and put your shoes back on if you like. You know, make yourself comfortable. This is it. Listen up, okay? So the day's been good to you? Today? Mm hmm Yeah, so far so good. Okay, okay. Back to work tomorrow. Ah, uh, I see, I see. What are your dreams and stuff like that? What do you actually like want to do besides? Uh, I don't know, I don't know. I mean, I think I'm trying to figure it out a little uh -huh. bit. I want to travel. Mm -hmm. Like, I want to go to Europe, and then I want to go to like Spain. Ooh, sorry. No, you good, you good. Like if that could be my career, you nope. know what I mean? And why haven't you? Mmm, mm, she being too walking and touching. You know what I mean? Observing. Work at a restaurant? You can hear good? Yeah. And how's the pay? How's the what? The pay. Uh, I've had, I've had better, I've had worse. Mm -hmm. I pay the bills, you know? Do you feel like 
You need help financially? Like, like what do you mean? Look, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna beat around the bush. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep it, I'm gonna keep it straightforward with you. I pay for, for, for like women's, I guess you could say, their presence. You know, just take care of them, pay their bills. You know, help them get around. It's a win-win. You know, I help pay. They keep me company. Everyone is happy at the end of the day. You kind of get what um, what I'm throwing at you. I, I don't know what you're talking about. Like, what do you mean? I'm a sugar daddy. Okay. You're someone that. If you ever had a sugar daddy before, you would know sugar daddies don't say that. Sugar daddy, don't say that. Red flag! Ooh, tomato, tomato! I can see that I can definitely provide for. Your energy is super contagious and it's something that, you know, I would love to see more of. You know, you're struggling and everything like that and I feel like I can give you an easier option. <laughs> like, are you like, ask, like, what are you asking me? Like, what? I'm asking you to be my sugar baby. <laughs> I ain't never had a Becca before. I'm dating Josh. You don't have to no, be Josh. No, no. Oh, that's totally really, really tomato, tomato. I don't really care about that. My, 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 my point is with you. I know you got bills, right? They be expensive. I mean, does Yosh help you with your bills? No. I can easily play for those. You got Apple Pay, right? Yeah. Give me your number. My phone number. Give me your number. What do you like? For what? This is where things get interesting. See, before the test, we sent Carlos three hundred dollars. Let me know when you get it. <laughs> I would not use this wisely. <laughs> Carlos will now send this money to Becca to help her pay some bills and to prove to her that he means business. How much is your water bill? Like twenty dollars. Sent you twenty. Like Did you, you just get the twenty? Twenty dollars. Yeah. Like why? I don't. I mean, you say you need to help with your bills, right? Yeah. What else you got? What, what? What? What's another bill do you have? What's your? What's your electric bill? Forty. Are you just like sending me like? Yeah, like, I mean, I, I, I'm gonna help. I'm gonna help you take care of the bills. This is what you need, right? This is what you need to get done, so you can do what you want to do. If it was only that easy, or if it was only those type of guys, those type of guys are hot. Are you serious right now? Yeah, you just got the forty. I'm about to go ahead and slide over you like one fifty. You're not gonna send me. $150. You think I'm playing? Like why? Like I just like I just met you. Like I hey, it's really nothing to be honest. I take care of all my babies. All, all my babies, babies be taken care of. All your babies? Yeah, you could be one of my babies if you want to. I showed you exactly what I could do. How how easy I could provide for you. Get it done but just like that. Not yet. <laughs> I know you're thinking about it. I know it's probably running through your mind this entire time. I just gave you proof and gave, let you see right then and there that I can do exactly what I said. You could treat it like a relationship, you can see it as a relationship if you want to, but at the end of the day, you're just getting an extra bag, right? I, I know it's a lot that's coming to you and stuff like that, so that's stuff happening in your but have you ever done something like this before? You don't got a lot. You And what do you mean? Which one? I know they got like a, a, a lot of them. Uh, Seeking the brain. Nigga. He knows. But you were talking to them? Yeah, but I stopped. What made you actually initiate you actually want to go do? I mean, go it's do just that. like. It was like easy and like they were usually really nice. I mean, I never like feel like anyone like took advantage of me or anything and so I don't know I mean why wouldn't I you know I have a bunch of friends that did that as well so what's the difference between you have done it before and then you doing it now with me okay I'm a pretty cool calm collected dude I don't feel like I cause no harm right. but like what would you want like for me like I never even had to meet them in person like uh -huh. it's all online damn it sounds like she's considering it what we'll do is we'll go in ahead and we'll just take things slow you know take it day by day Conversation by conversation, we'll see exactly where the vibe goes, what type of connection we can actually build within one another. So you want to hang out? Yeah. As friends? Mm. Not as friends. Right, so that's what I'm asking. Dang. We could go out, we, we go, we could do what you want to do, we could go shopping, I'll help you with everything that you got to do. Once everything seems like it's smoothing over and it's very, very comfortable, then just let the magic happen from there, go, right? <laughs> we just have to be a little more intimate, it's not just friends. Like I'm literally helping you get to the next level. So you wanna f me? 
Oh my god. <laughs> Carlos has no idea how to respond to that. <laughs> That's all. It's a question. But I guess you can say that. But also, not only just, I just want to be able to provide for you, make life easier for you. You can be waking up to this every single morning. So as long as you 100% sure you were down with it and you're down for me, don't just be down with the money. You got to be down for me. Well, yeah, but again, like, I'm dating Josh. I know. Yosh is a good dude. Yosh is definitely a good dude. But like you say, you want to be able to travel and stuff, right? I you want to be able to do things. Let's make it happen. I'm ready. I feel like you good. I got you. No, I'm, I'm actually like, I'm not down. I'm gonna send you, I'm, gonna, I'm paying you back right now, all of the- What do you mean you're not down? Like I'm with Josh and I wanna be with Josh. And so I feel like- But you was just literally giving me like all this type of energy that you was kind of like, no, okay with it. I'm not, I'm not down, I don't wanna do it. I'm gonna send you the money back. And like, I just, feel, I just like feel really like bad. Feel Either she peeped one of the cameras or it just not feeling right. Oh, gross, I like don't want to, so I'm sending it back to you right now. But I say we go and take our time. You know, you go at your pace. Well, you was kind of making the guidelines to all of this. Yeah, so like, I'm just like, I'm out. What the heck? You 100% out? Yeah, I'm not, I'm not down, I don't want to do it. Is there a reason, did I do something wrong? No, I just like thought about it and like, the money's just not worth it. Oh, damn. All right. <laughs> I'm sure you can find other shipping babies, right? Yeah. I just like don't. Period. I'm not gonna say I had no hope for us. I was just saying for him. His face looked like he didn't I had he didn't had hope for his girl, so but I just don't feel like that's like the life for me. I yeah. just like I left that behind. Like having like a sugar daddy that I like live with or whatever, you know. So it's kinda that's just it's just crazy how your energy changed though. Like you really sound super confident in it. I just thought about that. <laughs> Remember the cash from earlier of this video? You can show all that money. You go for that bow, bow, bow. You can change your energy. Bow, 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 bow. Probably not. You know it's fake money, but still. I'm in the mirror and I thought this is wrong. I guess it's understandable. Well, I, I can't argue with you. I mean, like I said, Yosh is a good dude. Now I can see he's very lucky to have someone like you by his side. So, um, the offer's off the table. Good. That's a pass. Is that a pass to you? That's a f***ing pass. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, man. That's a pass to you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so Becca turns Carlos's offer down and remains loyal to Josh. Now, to me, it sounded like she was on the verge of failing. But nonetheless, Josh considers the results of this test as a pass. Jesus Christ, I can feel again. <laughs> uh. We'll just wait for him to get back. Let's try to just act like he ain't even left. And we were just chilling. We were just eating and enjoying the food and everything like that. It's like this really big release right now. I, <laughs> I don't even know how to describe it. When he comes in, we'll just go from there. Yeah. All right, all right. Are you going to tell her that you've been watching? No. no. <laughs> you don't want to tell her about any of this? No. So you want to call <laughs> it a day here? I'm You're calling. done listening yeah, 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 yeah. in. I'm You're calling. positive. Yes, 100%. <laughs> yeah. Hey, my apologies if it, like if I made you like feel uncomfortable or anything like that. Like it really wasn't my intention. No, it's only good. It's okay. Like you're We are gonna send you back up there with this bag of stuff because we gotta make it look like you went to the store. You are gonna go back up there and you're just gonna play this entire thing off, okay? You know, Josh is on his way back. He should be. He should be on his way. Don't act too happy, bro, or too sad. Just act normal. Just act normal, okay? We'll talk later. My God. How do you go in and act normal after that like roller coaster of like emotions? Since Josh didn't want to tell Becca about the test, the plan was for him to just hang out there for a bit and then eventually make up an excuse for them to go home. Not long after he walked in though, Becca beat him to the punch. Um, I actually, my coworker asked me if I could cover her shift tonight. I told her I could. So I really need to get back to make that shift. Um, and I think with traffic we have to leave like now. Thank you for having us though, it was really nice. Of course. Oh, dang. You can tell she's mad. It's awkward. She's mad. She knows! She knows! I think she peeped the cameras. I'm jacking it. Appreciate you. Yep. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. She was uncomfortable. I've been comfortable too with uh, Carlos trying to Good make me sugar baby. <laughs> Although I don't think I would have denied him. Damn, I'm so 
Yeah, yeah, bro. Just hit me. Be safe. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, bro. always. Thanks again, man. Yes, sir. All right. If you had to give her a grade, what would you give her? Mm. It was a pass, but it was an A. Okay. I feel that. Yeah. I'll give her credit because she passed. And you know what? Josh is happy. Yeah. And it shows that she's trying. So I want to know what you guys think. In the end, Becca ended up saying no. Maybe she really changed her mind because of Josh, maybe it was something else, or maybe she caught on to the fact that she was being tested. I don't know. How do you guys interpret this? And if this were your relationship, what would you have to She caught on. I'm about to read the motherfucking comments. I don't know. I'm getting I'm just getting the sense of vibe that she caught on. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. I'm running out of memory, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and comment, 